somebody just leaked over 2,000 N8 and workflow, a full collection, tons of categories. I mean, the sky is the limit what's in here. And what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna take this Git repository, which most of you can't even use or know how to use, and I'm gonna turn it into a full operating website with everything in here, filters, you could go in, you could view the automation, you can download the workflow, go right into NA8, click import, and with two clicks, you're gonna get all of the craziest N8 and workflows that you could put into your system, into your business. You could sell this, whatever the heck you want to do with it. And we're going to do it all using Abacus AI and their deep agent, which is right here. 100% done for you. I gave it one prompt, the link to the Git, and in about eight minutes, it finished the whole website for me and it's actually deployed. You could see all the links below. You guys could see this. You could start using it, sharing it, and go in here and get all of your workflows. Pretty insane what we could do now with these agents and especially this one. I've been using this one so much recently because it's so helpful. This would have taken me probably three hours using no code tools to actually build. It did it in eight minutes with one link and one prompt. Let's jump right into it. If you guys want to learn how to build stuff with agents or no, actually I'll take that back. If you want to learn how to watch your agent build incredible websites, this is the video for you. So let's get into it. My favorite part, let's actually code. All right. So we're going to be using Abacus AI and we're going to be using the new God mode AI agent. So I've done many videos on this. It's my favorite tool. It does everything for you. We just got to make sure we prompt it well, and it's going to actually spit out everything that we actually want with zero code, not even tinkering around in IDE. Like it does all the work for you. So in today's video, we're going to be covering these workflows. So this gentleman right here, Zai619 has 2052 N8N workflows with all of the documentation, all the JSON files. So if you're familiar with NA8, you know how hard it is to build these workflows and he has it. He's collected all of these for a long time. Here's all the categories. You got AI agents, development, business process, cloud storage, communication, and so on and so on. But we want to basically create a really nice looking UI UX website that's going to be ours that we could display this to the public. It's all open source and that's where we're creating it. So let's just jump right into it. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up chat LLM. And if you look down here, there is a deep agent. So we can click on that and then it's going to bring us up to the agent. And this is, as you can see, I've built probably 30, 40 different projects with this agent. Let's go back to it. We're going to copy this URL. We're going to go back to the agent and we're going to say this. I want to take this Git repository and I want to create a full website. I'm going to provide you with all of the documentation so you can easily create a next.js website with all of the functionality, filter systems, search function, categorizing, and making it a full-blown directory for the 2000 workflows inside of this Git repository. Then we're gonna paste the link, and then we're gonna say this. Let's first discuss exactly how we want to build this. And then most important part is I'm gonna go in, and like I mentioned, Zai69 has all of the different documentation. So we're just going to go in and we're going to copy this whole list. So this is for the no code vibe code community because there is instructions here on how to do this, but you have to set up Python. You have to set up all of these directories. You have to actually set everything up on your local system, but we don't want to actually build it so we could launch it to the public and put it out there for free so people can actually access it. Can you do this without the deep agent? Of course you can, but that's why I'm going to show you the power of what this thing can do without you having to do anything. So now we're going to say, here is the readme file and all of the documentation. And all we got to do is paste it. Now the deep agent is going to get to work and it's going to read through everything first, which is very important get an understanding full breakdown of what is in there. And then also what we actually want to build. Here's everything it did. So I pasted, here's all the info. And then this is the breakdown. It says, it analyzed all the repository and it said, based on your comprehensive analysis of this Git, here is the analysis, pulled in every single piece, the scale, volume, naming, naming conventions, all of the JSON structures, the categories, pretty much everything in here. And then it says recommendation for the search. 
So it takes all the search features. And then here is the actual ideas of what it wants to build. So number one option is enhanced modern web app, <coughs> excuse me, which it recommends. And it's going to be a next.js project, which I already mentioned. It's going to say leverage the existing categories. Perfect. Implement advanced search, add visual workflow previews, include download functionality, mobile responsive design. Perfect. That's it. I don't even have to read the others. Extended existing system hybrid approach. Nope, we're going to go with that. So it says my recommendation is option one. Build a modern JS website that processes everything, structures everything. And then it says, would you like me to proceed with building this modern search website? I can create something that's much more user friendly with our current system while leveraging all their great organization work. Think about what just happened. I literally gave it a Git repository with a readme file. And this agent is made a whole plan. And now it's going to go in and actually start coding the whole website. Let's build it, but only do 50 workflows so it's much faster. Once everything works, then we can bring in the remaining thousands of workflows. Boom. And just like that, we want to simplify. I don't want them to get to work because the thing with agents is since they're working autonomously, they just going to go off and start building this. And it's going to probably take 10, 15 minutes. I'll let you know exactly how long it took. But again, to make it faster, we just needed to build all the features. We don't need it to pull in every single one and break every single one down and import everything yet. Let's just start with the basics. So while the agent is up and running, I want to show you what Abacus AI can do. One thing it can do is give you access to all 25 large language models. There's a router system where if you just type in something like, can you write me a one minute TikTok video? It's going to use the route system and it's going to take Gemini 2.5 flash to write it. But let's say you're like, I want to use Claude 37, use that. You can also use O3, DeepSeek, the brand new DeepSeek, GPT-4, Grok 4. I mean, everything is in here. 25, even Kimi K2 is in here, which just launched yesterday. They already have it inside of here. Abacus is having access to endless LLMs, pretty much all of them and then for different tasks. So it's going to pick if you use the route system. So if you're in route LLM and say this, can you give me a code simple Python visualizer of the galaxy? Then route LLM is going to take the best development model, which is Claude 4 Sonnet. And there it is. So that's how the routing works. And there's a bunch of other tools. There's a code LLM, which is a dedicated IDE, which you can actually download just like cursor works exactly like it. It sits on your desktop. Here it is right here. I was just working in it, building out a project. So this sits on your computer and you're able to do a lot more complicated tasks. And then you have app LLM. And this will actually build out all of your custom apps using the deep agent. And then outside of that, I mean, pretty much anything you could imagine. You got image generation, all of the different models for image generation, all the best. You, just, you essentially get access as an all-in-one tool to give you everything. You could do code, playground, PowerPoint presentation, deep research, and a ton more. Generate documents, video generation, lip sync, text, hu you know, tasks, humanize your video, humanize your text, video analysis, scraping URLs, endless. Go through it, play with it. All the links are below, and I do always appreciate it. Buys me a cup of coffee. All right, let's get back to our agent. My favorite part of Abacus and this deep agent is just watching this thing work because it goes in between screens. It starts pulling all the different data. It writes so fast, as you can see here. So right now we're working on the hooks and the visualizer, building out the search function. I mean, look at this thing. It's like bang, bang, bang. And if you guys want to check out other videos, I got a ton of my channel using Abacus to do all kinds of crazy stuff from Twitter automations to scrapers to building full-blown websites. It's pretty incredible what you can actually accomplish with a good prompt and a few words and using common language and letting it just run off and do this. Here we are, N8N workflows, discover and download automation workflows. Search for filters. Look at this, full site with all the information, training feedback automation. It's got a web hook, 16 nodes. AI machine learning complex. We can view details, training feedback automation. Here's our download workflow. We could click on that. It's gonna download it for us. Let's go into our workflow, download our file, import it here, and here we go. And there it is. Just like that, in a matter of minutes, this thing was able to take everything from Git. If you had no idea how to do this before, 
you don't have to learn all the coding. Put it into the agent, it built it. I'm gonna continue tweaking this, but you get to see the power of these agents now is, is really getting out of control. And just like that, we have our completed project from start to finish. We took the Git, we brought it in, we let the agent build the whole website. We didn't have to bother with anything. No complicated terminal setups, no local hosting, none of that. It's all done in here. And then all I gotta do left is hit deploy. We're gonna call this free N8N workflows. Hit deploy. It's finished. And now we're gonna be able to go in and actually look at the final website. So if you guys wanna take a look at it, I have all the links below and check this out. Perfect, you got the GitHub link here. It even made a night mode. Look how sick that looks. You have all your filters, development, automation, communication. You could click view details right there, download the workflow. Here's the file and we are done. Incredible. So you guys could go check this out. And of course, if you wanna check Abacus AI, definitely have a play with DeepAgent and all the other tools. And I will always appreciate the free cup of coffee. Also, I have a link for NA8 below if you guys do wanna try it. I think it's a fantastic tool. I'm not a big automation workflow guy, but once I saw this, I realized that so many people are using this to scale, grow their business, make a lot of money doing these workflow businesses, selling this as an agency play. So I wanted to build this for you guys and you guys could go in there and check it out and use it as a free resource and definitely share with your communities. And for now, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out.